Hi everyone, it's Michael from Frontline Web. Uh, today, Wix announced the rollout of the option of using HTTPS, which I would highly recommend as it's become it's going to become a, a Google um, ranking sig signal as Google wants all sites to be secure. So I'm going to quickly uh, have a walk through how it's done because uh, what we need to do is change um, our listing uh, within Search Console because Google have separate properties for HTTP sites and HTTPS sites. That's a mouthful, we've had a drink. But anyway, a quick run through. So we'll, we'll go onto the page. It's the website I've done a few months ago for a, a company. So we've got on the front page, so that we're just going to press Manage Site. Then we're going to click Domain. And there was a checkbox there, so I've checked it just a moment ago. So you're ready to roll on there. Now we're going to go over to Search Console. Now I have uh, the HTTP format for AutoShine at the moment. I'm going to leave that because Google will call, still crawl that for a while, but we'll switch over to the HTTPS once it's found it. So all we do is add a new property. I have already copied the URL, so I'm going to type in, there you go, and you do the same with the HTTPS. Then we're just going to add. And we want alternative methods, and we want a HTML tag. So we just copy that, like so. Then we go back to our Wix account, and we need to go into Edit Site. Uh, once we're there, we go to Site. And we go to Site Manager. And then we press SEO. And then see, I have the old code code there, but I'm going to keep the old code code there for the HTTP site. Uh, just paste that in then we press publish back to the search console and we'll quickly verify so we're verified so we continue and obviously uh, the first thing I'm going to do is crawl I'm going to submit a sitemap straight away so we're going to add one so we all know it's sitemap.xml I submit that refresh the page there you go one page smeared because basically it's a strip and column website then we're going to fetch uh, sorry we're going to fetch the pages so I'm just going to fetch the desktop Request for indexing. So that's all the ones with a river. I always mess these up sometimes. There we go. I think that's all right. Right, I'm going to crawl this URL on its direct links, and then you would do the same with my mobile smartphone. So then we go back to international targeting, and I always put a country. And it's already associated with the United Kingdom anyway. So then we go on to analytics and we find auto shine there. Then we will go to all website data. Then we're going to click admin, property settings. Now we've got it default URL is HTTP, so we need to change that to HTTPS. Or website data we quickly save that and now we're going to just search console which links the the data from search console to Google Analytics and vice versa so we're going to render it now we just have to find the HCSP that's it the version there 
and we just press save. So that's a new association. So now we're done. Now that is very easy, yeah? Um, eventually, um, Google will drop the HTTP and stop searching that and use the default setting of HTTPS as it's it's all rolled up. No need for 301 directs. Just set up a new search console property with a HTTPS and link your analytics to that. So Google just sent confirmation of that. So that's it. Many thanks.